Welcome back everyone to Let's Play Amnesia the Dark Descent. I'm VAC Quest and let's continue on in the main story. Now I will point out that I am somewhat immune to the scare factors in Amnesia. Like the dancing shadows, the um, certain behaviors of the monsters, and Basically, the dumb ones I'm not afraid of. <clears throat> he unraveled the cloth, protecting the orb. Alexander reached out and picked it up, held it up against the light. Cover it, he said. Keep it covered at all times. When we last left off, we were going to the northern prison block. Oh, we don't need the lantern while we're going through this tunnel. <coughs> There's nothing in the other tunnel, by the way, everyone. Just a cheap scare. Okay, storage. Kitchen. Oh, let's go to storage first, everyone. As far as I know. There really isn't anything here. You're dead, dude. <laughs> Cell area three. Storage. arrived at the village of Altstadt. It's a haven in the midst of a vast forest and the last stop before my final destination, Castle Brennenburg. It's late in the evening and the outrider, who has been with the coach since Bremen, advised me to wait until morning before I venture further. I've arranged for a bed at Der Müller, the village's only inn, and am now waiting for the sun to rise. I try to sleep, but as I close my eyes, I see the men who fell victim in London. My fear and shame forces me to witness the same scenes over and over. They are dead because of me. Well, technically, you're wrong about that, Daniel. They're dead because of the shadow. Oh, bugger. Why did I even open that door? I just have to wait for the monster to pass by.
Oh, well. It was worth me risking that. Okay. Let's uh, use our lantern for a bit. Because we got way... We've got a lot of oil. Okay. Oh, nice. Tinderboxes. What's in here? <gasps> Another oil and some more tinderboxes, everyone. Glass jar. That looks like it's a quest item. Now, you can't tell me that this is not a smart idea. I'm going to build myself a little barricade. No, you don't get that option. Okay. Now, that's going to be good. This can be here, and my chair here, for when I need to vault over it. Oh, yes. Here he comes. <sighs> Crouch. Go over here. <clears throat> See, this is the bit where you gotta be very creative with your barricades. Okay, that monster is gone. He buggered off. All right. Let's go back to the kitchen, shall we? Yeah, we're going the right way. That's the good news. Alright. So, we lit our way back to th where we need to go. Oh, another note. 3rd of August, 1839. I feel like I have fled the world and all its worries. Brennenberg is a majestic creation perched upon a forest-clad hill with towers reaching well above even the highest pine trees. Following the winding road leading to the gates gives the impression of discovering something forgotten, as if journeying with Marco Polo to the hidden Xanadu. Alexander, the Baron, is a peculiar but gracious man. He seems well-versed in worldly matters, and is not at all as eccentric as I assumed. My room is exquisite, and I'm confident that no hotel for miles could even hope to match it. As the sun sets on Brennenberg, its fairy tale varnish turns to an eerie gloom. Alexander's strange servants are never far away. They are a quiet lot, and their behavior could only be described as skulking. Alexander seems pleased by my presence. As he puts it, it seems like I got here just in time. Yes, but in time for what, Daniel? That's something that you didn't bother to ask him. 
Oh look, smile. See that? <gasps> Run. Hide behind the piggies. I'm a piece of the wall. Oh. Will we see him? <sighs> okay, goldfish, you've done your search. Now get out of here. All right, grab that some of that acid. Here, I'll even prove to you that it's acid. Watch this. Let's get rid of some potatoes as well. There's a lot of them. A couple tinder boxes. Nothing up there. Alright, let's make our way back to storage. Let's hope that we don't get chased by a monster because I have no way of hiding from them right now. I don't trust anyway I haven't lit and lit. You see we're missing one journal entry. So maybe we gotta go the other way. Okay, that's where we are where the exit is. Oh, flashback. Hey you! Stop! Don't come any closer! I just wanna leave! You can't go outside! It's too dangerous! I'm telling Gabriel! I doubt that very much. What on earth did you do, Daniel? Oh, you are... Oh, bugger, you're kidding me. This is probably really stupid, just hiding up on the top here. Alright, goldfish, just go away. <sighs> if 
to if I have to run back to a safety door I will but um, I don't think that the goldfish will come this close to that e exit there yeah like I thought he knows I'm only just trying to survive Yeah, goldfish is gone. That's good. But where's that last note? That last journal? This is something I don't like to do, and that's search for journals. I mean, I got the one from there. I got the one from the kitchen. Where else is there one? why I gotta ask myself as a commentator. Where's the last one? And to be fair, I'm not really burning that much oil. Because I am... Because I am using it. I wonder... Oh, I know where that is. I was just there, wasn't I? Did I miss one down here by chance? There's a good possibility that I might have. I know that there's one more journal entry about Brennenberg. Otherwise, why would... Why wouldn't he complete that journal entry? I mean, true, it could have been stolen, but I doubt it. <sighs> I don't think that it's in the kitchen. Uh, where would I put it if I were Alexander or one of his goons? Well, there's no point looking for it. Let's just continue on. Okay, let's use that acid. And this. Hello there. Hey, goldfish. What's up? So where'd the goldfish go? That was interesting. At any rate, let's go into the cistern, everyone. Moving that orb was like pushing a star in the night sky. It wasn't supposed to happen. The shadow isn't, a veg isn't some vengeful spirit. It is the universe catching up with itself. Alright. When we come back, everyone, we will explore the cistern. But until then, everyone, I've been VXC Quest. You've been watching Let's Play Amnesia The Dark Descent. I'm saying the Phoenix is flying away now. Catch you on the next video. Later, everyone.